It's no secret that Hoboken has a major flooding problem. A few weeks ago, one night, uh, there was a heavy storm for only about three, three hours, heavy rain. And uh, that night when I went to go home, I couldn't get to my vehicle because both intersections were totally flooded up, like up to my knees. And I had to just wait hours for it to go down. Not to mention the impact that flooding has on his business. So it affects your business? Yes, absolutely. Thanks to a $230 million grant that the city of Hoboken won, they're working hard to keep the city rain resilient by using a ton of green innovation, such as a rain garden. The rain garden is uh, simply a piece of geography at the corner of an intersection, which is uh, beautified in the form of a garden, but can also absorb rain in the event of, of a storm. Here's how it works. The soil from the garden absorbs the water, as does the permeable pavement surrounding it. It sends all the water to a detention tank underground. This system right here can store about 1,500 gallons of water. These gardens are popping up throughout the city. Here on Garden and 4th, they've installed one on each corner, right in front of Sweet Coffee Shop, which used to see a ton of flooding. So, so we obviously have a basement unit um, where we keep a lot of the storage. So yeah, they had to install something, a whole system to alleviate for the flooding. Um, just because our basement kept getting flooded. The city applying those same principles on a bigger scale with the resiliency parks. This is the Southwest Resiliency Park. It's green, spacious, and a great space for residents. Underneath, it can hold up to 200,000 gallons of water. The Resiliency Park on 7th and Jackson can hold more than double that. But the piece de resistance is the Northwest Resiliency Park, which is expected to go online next year. That park will be able to hold 2 million gallons of rainwater. Reporting in Hoboken, Emily Young, New Jersey News Network.